FAQ Friday, how did I get started? And I've answered it before in a couple of other videos. But how I got started was in my very early 20s, around 20, 21. I just started using cardio DVDs uh, at home. And I also did a little bit of strength training, which uh, I am glad I did because if you do strength training along with cardio from the very beginning, the weight training will help you with um, uh, snapping back. I highly recommend doing both cardio and strength training from day one. I worked out probably, I don't even remember how many days a week I worked out, probably three days a week or something like that. I started off slow. I did not change the way I ate. I still had cheesesteaks, I just ate a smaller portion. I still had french fries, I just had a smaller portion. Once my body was like, oh wait, we're moving, you know, it the initial weight dropped off. After a while, you know, it started slowing down and uh, I realized that I did have to start changing the way I was eating. How I got started lifting at the gym, I was doing Shalene Extreme uh, by Shalene Johnson and that made me fall in love with weightlifting. Um, so after I finished two rounds of Shalene Extreme, I believe, I then started doing P90X um, and loved that. Um, that introduced me to HIT, a HIT type of cardio, but I also was able to do my weightlifting and I still keep those principles to this day. I love HIIT, um, high intensity interval training. I love weightlifting. So after P90X, I hit another plateau and my boyfriend was, you know, super big into the gym. We were watching uh, Physiques of Greatness, uh, POG videos and Chris Jones had put out a series for women. Um, at that time, I was at a different gym. I think I was at LA Fitness at the time. And I told him, I'll go, you know, if you go with me to my gym and show me, you know, just walk me through all the exercises so that I know where everything is. So yeah, he went to LA Fitness with me um, for the very first two workouts, I believe. And then we went to his gym uh, for the last workout or something like that. Basically, it was a three-day split, you know, a bro split. After I started this program, I quickly realized that LA Fitness was not the gym for the goals I was trying to achieve. I left LA Fitness and I went to Retro Fitness with him. Um, I understand that I am truly blessed to have somebody there for free to show me if I'm doing something right, if I'm doing something wrong. Oh, you've been doing that for a long time, won't you switch this up? I completely understand that I am very, very, very blessed. But once I fell, started falling in love with that three day split, I started doing my own searching, you know, going to bodybuilder.com, going to YouTube, you know, and that's when I started getting into the bodybuilding, weightlifting communities um, to find new exercises to do. Because I knew what one exercise, once, once I got into the gym, I knew what the exercise looked like. And I knew what I wanted to focus on. So if I saw an exercise that kind of looked like it, I'm like, oh, well that works the same muscle. How about I stop doing this and I do that instead? You know, you can't teach someone how to love lifting. Um, it's just something that comes. And if it doesn't, that's fine. Then you should find something that you love. So I always say, 
try everything at least once um, and see if you like it. You should have some type of strength training in your program. Yeah, that's basically how I got started. I started at home with cardio DVDs because that's what was available to me um, back in the old days. Um, and uh, I did training videos that incorporated both cardio and strength training. They had weights, if they had bands, uh, stuff like that. That's what I was most interested in when I worked out from home. Then, you know, years passed and um, I got into the gym with lifting. I followed the training program, uh, the women's uh, training program by Physique of Greatness. And that got me into the gym, uh, lifting heavier weights. And I fall in love with that since. I've changed my program a million and one times. You know, I track everything in Google Docs or now it's called Google Drive because it's right on my phone. Um, when I walk in the gym, I highlight last week, um, make three new columns, copy paste, change the date, and there you go. Hopefully it's something that you fall in love with. I can't think of a day where lifting hasn't made me happy um, and we do it first thing in the morning 5 a.m get it out the way because then life gets in the way and even as much as i love it i cannot say that i would go home from work and go lift like and the amount of people that's in the gym at 6 p.m is just i can't i i can't no so um so yeah, I just wanted to do a quick <laughs> video. Um, I am sure this is going to be spliced up and edited and because I have rambled on and on and on, but I hope you get the gist of what I was trying to say. So like, comment, subscribe, and share. Thanks.